Welcome to Linux Help. Today we are going to see how to configure RAID 1 on Oracle Linux 8.6. The purpose of RAID 1 is to create an exact copy of data on two or more disks. Typically, two disks are used in a RAID 1 mirrored pair. In RAID 1, information is written to the first drive and then to the second drive at the same time. When a R drive fails in a mirror volume, the remaining drive can be used as a single drive without any data loss. First, I am going to check the OS version. We are currently using Oracle Linux Server version 8.6. Now, I am going to install the MDADM package which is a write managing tool. Check the devices available for the configuration of RAID. Run the following command. I have created two disks with 10 GB of size. Create the partition for two disks by executing the following command. Create new partition N. Select primary. Enter the size of the partition 5 GB. To change the partition type, enter T. To list all the codes, press L. Enter FD to Linux RAID Auto write and quit repeat the above mentioned steps to create partition for another block SDC Next, check the block details for any previous configuration that has been made. Execute the following command to check. There is no super block detected. Now, I am going to create the MD device and select the right levels by using the following command Now it's been created. To verify the status of RAID level, use the following command. The created partition STB1, the RAID level is 1 and another partition SDC1 RAID level 1 to verify the MD device status run the following command
now I am going to create a file system for MD device create a directory to mount the MD device write one run the block id command enter the details in fstab file run the following command copy the UUID number write and quit execute mount command and check the status of the mounted write device now the write one is successfully mounted the md1 device is successfully mounted with this, the configuration of RAID 1 on Oracle Linux 8.6 has come to an end. Thank you for watching this video, and if you like it, please subscribe to our channel. To learn more tutorials, visit www.linuxhelp.com. And if you have any queries, mail us to support at linuxhelp.com.